panic in Bongi. Word quickly spread that rebels could be making their way to the capital. We were in the city center when suddenly everyone around us started running and traders were closing their shops. Many were here in 2013 when the mostly Muslim armed group Seleka arrived in force and overthrew the then president Francois Bozizé. So no one wants to be caught unawares this time. It turns out an incident in the PK-12 suburb on the outskirts of the city triggered the commotion. We have been told that government troops and trucks came speeding into the city. People panicked and started running. The soldiers fired into the air to contain the population, but that only caused more panic. We went to PK-12 and found more of the same. This man told us he is fed up and frustrated. Need the peace. We need the peace. Trouble is always in CARY. I would like to know what all the international forces are doing here, yet there is no peace, he says. It's an emotional time for everyone ahead of Sunday's general election. What's happening here just shows how much fear and tension there is ahead of the election. People we've been talking to are saying that they're worried that the rebels could be advancing, even if the fighting is going on in the countryside many kilometers away from Bongi. Some of the country's main armed groups have joined forces, calling themselves the Patriots for Change. Here they are threatening to march to Bongi, demanding the election be postponed and a transitional government formed. State and UN officials have accused former President Bozize of starting a rebellion in an attempt to overthrow the government and disrupt the polls. Uh, since last Friday, where uh, the alliance between the ex-president Bozize and the three armed groups have attacked is up in, in this area in uh, Bosembeli. Uh, and down around Greece, this deputy head of the UN mission tells us the blue helmets are protecting main supply routes and towns. The whole rest of the country, 71% uh, of the voter registration sites where the electoral cards are distributed are open and people are coming massively as they are in Bangui, which I saw myself yesterday, to get their electoral card. Most of the opposition presidential candidates have stopped their election campaigns and want the poll rescheduled. The government, however, says that is not an option. Catherine Soy, Al Jazeera, Bongi.